Boom. What up, Solar Neck and only here back doing some more League of Legends action. Oh, he interrupted my E. I didn't even know you could do that. Oh, oh no. what up? Today's video is sponsored by Vikings War of Clans. Vikings War of Clans was inspired by the famous RPG games of the 90s, like my personal favorite Age of Empires that we all loved and played with the dedication that youngsters today would not understand. What makes the Viking world so addictive is that 20 million online players are constantly changing how the game evolves through a never-ending fight for resources, forging of new alliances, and competing in live events. Support my channel by downloading Vikings War of Clans for free from my link down in the video description box below. You will also get a bonus 200 gold and an initial protection shield. Also, don't forget to look me up and join my Viking clan under the tag Solo Renekta. Now let's get back into today's video. Oh no, we had a sick, a sick secret play set up. Dang, whatever, he got his flash out of him, but that kind of sucked. Brother, you're on your own on that one. I have E, level one. I mean, you're Udyr. You can get that fine. You just smite it, brother. You okay? All right. I, I don't think he backed. Damn, I did not realize he could knock me away with his, uh, with his Q. Anyways, boom. What up? Solar Neck and Only here. Back doing some more League of Legends action play. It's a poppy at the top lane. Uh, we, ooh, give me that. We're doing a pretty AD heavy build. Not pretty AD. I mean, it's literally full AD. <laughs> it's going to be, uh, Triforce into double lethality items. So, Ghost Blade. And then Dusk Blade. Uh, I gotta kind of chill a little bit though. Because I have E and I don't have level 2 yet. Once we get level 2, we can do some stuffs. Hey, now we can play the game. Oh, the other minion was not in range. Not today, punk. Not today. Keep auto trading here. I have grass, but these, so these prolonged trades always favor me. Plus, my Q is relatively low cooldown. His is too, but that don't matter. Get a grass proc off of that. Oh my god. Back into the bush to drop minion aggro. Ooh. I didn't power auto attack coming up, so I kind of knew he was just dead there. You can't take that trade, sir. I'm a poppy. I do a ridiculous amount of damage. That auto attack, though. Oof. See, empowered auto from the passive. 350 range. Also has grasp, grasp proc applied to it as well. Pretty big. Pretty big. All right. Um. Hmm. Let's get a ward down here. I also put an extra point into Q there, so I would have a little bit more damage in that trade. Normally I would take W third, obviously, but if I'm in an all-in trade and I'm not gonna need and I'm not gonna need the uh, W, why not just take the extra point in Q, get a little bit extra damage off on it? Maybe help me win that all-in a little bit easier. Missed both those minions like a noob. All right, let's get out of here. Let's go. Try first. First. Unfortunately, we don't have enough for Sheen. Part of me really wants to stick around for Sheen because I'm super greedy and a very dumb player. I would highly advise you don't do what I'm doing right now. I'm just being dumb because I'm greedy. All right. Ooh. Pretty sure I can just walk away here. Okay. Good try, Yasuo Jungle. <laughs> I'm gonna go back to base real quick, get my sheen and run back. Uh, I don't think he can shove fast enough. The next wave should catch outside of tower. Alrighty. Don't need to be full HP or full uh, mana. Because obviously, remember, you're running back to lane. What do you have? You got regen. So as you're running back to lane. Oh, no. If it gets to here, melees might be in tower range. Ooh, okay. Beautiful. Now, I didn't think it was going to work perfectly like this, but hey, I'll take it. Uh, he has to be careful because their, their top is still over there as well. Yeah. This could be a really bad idea. Oh, no. If he jumps over, he could definitely die. What? Okay. Interesting. By the way, if you hit a... If you kill a minion or a unit or whatever with your... Okay. If you kill a unit with your uh, passive, that auto attack, the ranged auto attack... The shield will immediately come back to you. But if you don't kill a unit, it'll just randomly, like, fly out. So, I kill a unit, it flies right back to me. 
I'll show you next time when it's back off a of cooldown. I'll throw it on a non-killable minion. Dude, I'm missing way too many CS. Standard. All right. Oh, I was supposed to show you. Not bad. Either way, you'll see it. When I hit something that doesn't die instantly, it'll just fly off in a random direction. So you can use that to your uh, benefit. Like if you're in an all-in fight, but you need the shield instantly and you don't have time to go like pick it up, you can auto-attack a minion that was like low HP near you. Like you're gonna lose the auto-attack power obviously, but you'll get the shield instantly instead of maybe not getting it. Could be pretty useful. Ooh. Did not move the uh, mouse very well. That input buffer is really hard. Hmm. Okay. Get my ward down. I can keep playing aggro on this guy. I don't really think he can do much against me. Oof. The proc. See how it just flies off in a random direction? I did lose a lot of minions for that uh, poke damage right there. I'm going to walk over here and get this plant real quick. You can see it that it's available on my mini-map. Sweet. Oh, my jungler's invading. Their mid can collapse on this super easy. Then again, it is Yasuo jungle. Oh, yeah. Goes about how you thought it would. Oh, I leveled up. I was going to go for an all-in. Feels bad, man. All right. Yeah, I was about to drop my ignite and stuff and go for the all-in, but whatever. Hit him with the empowered hit. Grab that. Man. Yeah, that kind of sucked. I was going to go for the all-in there, but whatever. Boom. I still might go for the all-in. If I walk up and he, like, tries to cue me, that's how we win. Ideally, he auto-attacks me. Because then he pulls aggro from all these minions. I'm trying to stand like right next to him so he just autos me. Yeah. See how all the minions are hitting him? I'm a bit disappointed in how that went. I really felt like I was, in, I was gonna hit him off this wall. I keep doing that. I did this in a game earlier. I have my camera like this. So I'm like in my brain, I'm like, okay, He's hitting it if I hit him this way. If I E him like this, he's going to hit the wall. But that's not how it works. So you move your camera like this, you're really just pushing him into this little choke. I really felt like I had him into the wall there, but... Okay. Because I had to stick around longer to finish him because I got less damage off. And he could reply with damage onto me. That was pretty annoying. I mean, I come out wicked far ahead in terms of how the wave man or the wave like comes out because I have the wave shoving in the tower, so he misses all those minions, and the wave bounces out to me, so I come back to a bigger wave than he does and a better positioning for the future. But that was definitely doable without dying. All I have to do, is, I think, I have to flash more in this direction to get a better angle on that. Poor play. Hit that shield, baby. Bloop. Grass proc. Damage is real, baby. Probably not the greatest idea to tank all these minions up, but it's all good. We got a nice CS lead. I'm probably just going to shove this in back and get like boot upgrade and stuff. Or regular boot, rather. Oh no, I hate this. And they're all like 1 HP. Okay. I think he backed. I could go get Scuttle right here. Ooh. I guess I could be doing this. Okay. Just checking. Just checking. Mm, he's going to be back on this wave. I have to shove this fast in the bail. I could leave on this wave too. It wouldn't be a bad idea either. But. I just walk away from you. But. Alrighty then. Back to base I go. Not too bad. We're gonna be able to catch this wave, I believe. Dude, my jungle is huge. He's four kills right now. Boots and mobility is running around like crazy. I love it. 
Just W back to lane. Ooh, jungler's topside. Strangely enough. They might be doing this, maybe? I don't know. Uh, I don't really know why he's topside, seeing as they already took this. Invading jungle, potentially. That's possible. That's probably the most likely thing. Because this guy went MIA, too. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Okay. Oh, uh, no, no, never mind. They're going mid to gank. They just ran through like this. So he didn't get spotted on the wards. Interesting. I just want to shove here. Then I'm probably going to roam mid myself. There's going to be a lot of action down there. I'm going. He's taking no damage. Oof. I'm coming down. I'm like halfway. I'll take it. Just want to focus. Ooh! E? Nope. I'll take it, though. I didn't get any of those? Whatever. <laughs> I'll take it. Whee! Don't worry, my friend. I'm not going to steal it from you. I just wanted to use it to get back to lane a little faster. All right, I'll take it. Probably could have played that out differently. I just want to make sure uh, the Tristana died there. Because that was, that was our biggest threat. So I want to make sure that person died. After that, don't really care how it plays out. This is annoying. This is why I really wish I got one of those kills. Literally just one of those kills and I'd be able to buy my item. Lame. It's all right, though. Run back to base. This dude is diving deep. And dying. <laughs> Alright. Big thing here is this guy not dying. And this dude. Because they both have huge shutdowns. And all these people scale so hard. Well, these three at least. I mean, this guy scales. Obviously, Lux scales too. But it's not the same. These two will scale to ridiculous damage healers. Like. Wukong specifically. Solo Q God. Even if he's super... Like, I've seen Wukong start 0-5, feed, the, feed their ass off, and then, like, the mid-game happens where everybody's spread out and they just walk around one-shotting everybody in Snowball. Uh, this guy's in MIA again. I feel like he's rotating. Okay, never mind. Sit back here. Oh, my grass bore off. hi -ya. Damn! And that's with a guy with a bunch of armor. Are you okay there, buddy? Are you dc Are you memeing? What are you doing? Are you okay? You're confusing me. Are you still chasing? What the hell? What is going on? Okay. That guy's trolling me. Like, I thought he was DC'd, but I think he's lagging. I thought he was DC'd, but then he W'd, and I'm like, you don't, you can't W when you're DC'd. <laughs> like, wait a second. Because it looked like he was just like, I think he was fake AFKing me. You know, like when a Blitzcrank does that shit? It's either that or he's just lagging. <laughs> but I do that shit on Blitzcrank sometimes. Oh, I gotta be careful. I'm gonna leave this down for a little bit. And then go pick it up right before it leaves. Never mind. The plan was to pick it up right before it leaves. That way I could keep the shield for as long as possible. While I wait for the next one to uh, be ready. Do something like this. A little bit better. I'd be careful. I don't have any mana. Can a minion. Trying to finish it. I see two. And then the jungle is probably... Or the top's lagging. So I think I'm okay to steal this. Away. Right. Don't care about that wave. Get me out of here. I got a ton of gold to spend. Whew. Double Infernal. Oh my god. That's huge. What'd I say, man? What'd I say? Wukong just starts popping off. Finishes one item. Then he's a god. Alright. Uh, let's go like this. I'm gonna go for that bot lane. Damn. I'm embarrassed. <laughs> Ooh, look at this build. Guess it's kinda solid against this guy. Never get caught out. I mean if you're staying if you're playing really far back, but she just got caught out dead. Oh? He's got two level advantage. This man's huge. 
This man's huge. Whew. Can't wait for the winter map. You think they're going to have a winter map? When's the last time they've done a winter one? Wait, did they do it last year? I think it might have been one of those things I turned off because the FPS was doo-doo. Yeah, I think they had a winter map last year. I just turned it off. I can't remember. Oh, boy. Thank God it actually went on the on the support there. Never mind. That's great. Yeah. <laughs> I said, as long as it doesn't go to one of these three people, that's huge. Because the support, like... Okay, I don't know. Lux can still spend the gold and get a lot of value out of it. This is not good. Oh, God. Lux is going to start carrying. I'm trying to get down there, but... Kind of far away here, boys. Woo! Got one. Got two. Bye bye. Interesting. Flippin' nice. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Thanks, Zyra, for your kind words. Bloop. Yeah, I do a lot of damage, boys. What's up? You done lagging over there, you little goofball? Let's get a ward up for him. I'm just gonna bail here and probably go cover bot side. I got my ghost blade in the bank. I'm gonna go grab it. Woo! <laughs> Flippin' nice. I like it. <laughs> what is it? Flippin' and then hecking. Those are the two. It's awkward. If you're just not gonna swear, just don't swear. Like, why do you gotta, like, fill it? Well, I don't know. I guess I do that for goofball. Because I use goofball. As a filler for some other stuff, I'd like to say. Oh god. This guy's pretty tanky. Sniped him, dude. Almost, almost one hit him with that thing. <gasps> oh shit, that's bad. All right, let's just heal up real quick. Yeah, 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 I'm cool with that. I don't mind. You can't do shit to me. <gasps> yeah, you can. Oh, correct. You don't want none of this, dude. I'm telling you. All right, dude. Meanwhile, this guy's taking everything. <gasps> I'm gonna catch him. Come out. What did I hit him for? I'm hitting like a truck right now. Jesus. Still not hitting hard enough to get a cannon minion though. That'll that'll always be true. That will always be true. I might just go back and get double long here. I'd like to get enough for this, but hold up. I'm gonna sit in this bush real quick. Might get a nice little player. Storm Razor next? Nah. Dusk Blade. I mean, pretty likely they're just gonna walk away from me. But get that shield. Blech. Oh! I was right next to it, dude. I should have done that. <laughs> I didn't think I was going to get hit by all of Lux's shit. Oh, they double ignited me too. I didn't think I was going to get hit by all of Lux's stuff. I thought I was going to be able to dodge with the E, but he was pretty far away from me. So by the time I actually hit the E, I was already getting hit by all of Lux's stuff. Unfortunately. If I juked out on the Lux's uh, damage there. I mean, obviously I'm still getting hit by Ignite. But if I don't get hit by either of these, that gives me an extra 350. And then I pick up that shield. That 350 should let me get the shield. And then maybe I kill the, uh, the Wukong. It's possible. What's our cooldown on this? Eight seconds, dude. That's crazy. Level 13 is the max, right? I'm pretty sure that's how all passives work. They scale up to level 13. Or not all, but... If it's like a passive that like scales over time, like Garen passive, level 13 is the max for that. Uh, GP passive on uh, barrels, level 13 is the max for like the recharge time. You know, like when the barrels tick down from like three hits to two hits to one hit, that time goes uh, down... Like, it happens faster over time. Like, level 13 is the max on that. Um, 
Ooh, he let it. Oh, brother. I'm missing everything. Wait up. Dude, you are so fast. Chill. Okay, dude. That's a little disappointing. <laughs> I thought he was going to try and fight me, dude. I played that, like, conservatively. Like, I just used all my stuff to catch him because I figured once I got to him, he'd fight me. I didn't think he'd just run away. Alright, outplayed. Outplayed. If I just didn't waste W here and I just held it, it would have been free, but I'm bad. Alright, I'm gonna try and find some people. Sneak attack mode. Sweet! Grab this. Oh, they're all going for this dude. He is massive right now. I don't want to go for this guy. Whoop. Come on! I'm so slow right now. Can't catch him. I need boot too. Need some boot two action. Nope. Shielded. Alright, I'm just gonna back and get boot two, man. I need those. Uh probably tabby, huh? Quad AD. Only one alright, they have two CCs. Still probably worth. Go tabby. Another long sword here. Pop the W. I'm using my W poorly to be completely honest. Like in this situation, I can just pop Ghost Blade and run at the guy, or just run at the guy. I popped everything because I was thinking about maybe going for the Trist that was right here. But you know, obviously as I ran, she walked this way. My E became pretty garbage. So I was like, all right, let's just go for the guarantee kill and get this guy. And that is what I did, or tried to do. Oh my god. Not even close, dude. I'm a survivor. <sighs> very, very, very close. <laughs> but I win. Alright, let's go bot. I can mess this dude up. Dude, I'm hitting like a truck right now. What's my AD? 340. My Q's dealing 300 for each hit. What? smashed into the wall holy moly i love it because you e and you get the immediate triforce proc so i'm eating for like 400 damage if i hit him into the wall it's doubled and then that first auto is like 234 plus all my ad so it's like 500 damage hit plus grass procs so it's even more never enough to get a cannon minion though but it is a lot oh there's ult out of him Oh, dude, look where he's standing. Dude, this guy's going in! Do you want to try and... Oh. Hit him! Oh, I thought he was going to E forward. <laughs> Baited! Hold up. E, baby! E, baby! Bye! I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. Get him, minions. Oh, I hate you. I can't see shit. Uh, dunked. Hold up. I got more, baby. The Q? Nope. Not this time, punk. Bye. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> 
Double Infernal Poppy. Huge damage. Let's go. Oh my god. Get out of here. Get out! The poppy damage is big, baby. God damn. Yo, Shea Baylor, thanks for the 15 months, bud. Old Red Kid, thanks for the three months, dude. I blood root, thanks for the prompts up, buddy. Welcome to the Crocodile Crew, you three. Appreciate it, my mans. Welcome. 14 and 2. This guy beasted. I took over at the end. Oh. Echo, what happened, my brother? 3,600 damage in a game where we're stomping them? <laughs> what happened, dude? Oh, no. All right. I'll take it, baby. I'll take it. Number one by a mile. Like I said, Wukong wasn't even doing amazing, but he just does a ridiculous amount of damage in those, like, skirmish-type fights where he just flies in with EQs immediately and then R's and you're dead before you can even respond. And he did it all coming out of stealth. Like, that champion in Snowball game super hard. Oof. Look at that healing, baby. Beautiful. Anyways, these are the runes we ran. Uh, from going further in this build, excuse me, uh... Probably want to go, like, defensive items here. So, well, <laughs> defensive items. So GA plus Sterics is probably what I would do for my last two here. Uh, you know, depending on what you need first. If you're if you're getting bursted out, then obviously go Sterics. If you're not getting bursted out, go GA. That's basically how I would think about it. Uh, yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed that one. Make sure to tune in next time, and I'll catch you guys then. If you're on YouTube right now, make sure to like the video, subscribe for more content. If you're on Twitch right now, make sure to follow the stream and check out the subscribe button at the top of your screen to see if you got a free twitch prime sub available and redeem that sucker right now on my channel anyways gg well played hope you guys enjoyed that one make sure to tune in next time i'll catch you guys then peace